It's time for Operation Football Skylights. Let's get busy with the Operation Football Game of the Week. And here we go, heading up to Carmel. Look at these uh, storm clouds off the west. Looks like something out of the Wizard of Oz, doesn't it? That's a little frightening, but the game goes on. Carmel facing Cathedral, second quarter. The pass is tipped, and Cathedral's Charler Montefalco with the pick. He takes it midfield right there. And then the weather rolls in. In fact, the fans were asked to leave the stadium because of some lightning in the area. Oh, no, everybody leaving. Game was delayed for about 30 minutes because of this. Look at the rain showers. It just simply poured and dumped. Look at the, oh, that's terrible, huh? We finally get back to the football. This is third quarter, 30 minutes later. Carmel up 3-0. Here come the Irish. Nick Najim gives the Irish the lead. The pounding touchdown right there, 7-3. Carmel has one last chance. A little trickery here, but the Irish win the game of the week on Operation Football. Moving on. Here we go, defending 5A champion Center Grove and the Trojan fans ready. Ready to defend that title. The Grove taking on Perry Meridian. Jimmy Daggett goes up the middle, 12 yards for the touchdown. Trojans up 19 to nothing. And Perry coach Scott Marsh, what do you think about that? <laughs> he, doesn't he doesn't like it very much. Just before the half, Center Grove after it again. Kyle Barth with a swing pass to Daggett. And doggone it, he's gone again. Working the sidelines, 36 yards. Center Grove is rolling. Not a good night for Perry. The party is spoiled tonight as Center Grove ruins the party. 32 nothing in final score. Let's go! Oh yeah, the defending 2A champion Heritage Christian Eagles finding their beat against Elwood. Here come the Eagles. Jackson currently to James Houck and then watch this. It's the running attack. Austin Olvey pounding his way to the goal line right here. The Eagles win. Is this right? 60 to nothing, your final score in that game. Yeah, the pick game of the week you voted for it at WTHR.com. Cloverdale at Speedway. Spark plugs taking care of business. JT Bowman, the big man on campus this week. He comes up with the interception, comes right at our camera because that's how you get airtime on Operation Football. Very next play, JT Bowman, here he is. He makes another big play. Quarterback Johnny West fires deep and Bowman catches the bomb. That's a 60-yard gainer. Just That's two big plays. Speedway finishes the deal. It's Jake Dunn says this one's done. Speedway wins 27-6, your final score. How do you like that? All right, we've reached halftime of Operation Football. We have more highlights coming up and the cheerleaders of the week.